Mr. Chairman, you know, I share the concerns that we just heard about. And, um, you know, certainly we recognize that there has been an uptick. Um, and, you know, I, I do give um, a lot of credence to the concerns I just heard about. But just understanding the language before us does not um, have this GPS monitoring for the first offense. You know, it's our intention through the legislature. We, we created a program, uh, 2019, I think it was, a diversionary program, particularly dealing with motor vehicle theft, um, which if a child completes that, the case is dismissed. Um, but this language that we're dealing with is those repeat offenders that we, we've heard about for the past year or so. Um, you know, that are stealing multiple cars and those kinds of things, um, and, and that would go into place. You know, I, I will tell you that story, that very tragic story that we heard about over the summer where uh, a young man was uh, murdered and dropped off in, in Waterbury, uh, Mary, St. Mary's Hospital in Waterbury. Um, you know, a very troubling aspect of that case was that he was on uh, an electronic monitoring system. I think it was September 29th, he was in court, and the issue was whether or not to take him off of that system. And you know who objected? It was the mom. She said, don't take him off that system. Something bad is going to happen. And three weeks later, he was murdered. Um, you know, so, you know, I think there is a, a positive aspect to that. The other thing I just want to bring attention to is Section 8 that I know the, um, the House chairman uh, talked about, which is this um, theft of a motor vehicle. This actually decreases the incidence that a case uh, for stealing a motor vehicle can be transferred to the adult court. Because under our law presently, larceny in the first degree is stealing something that is of value in excess of $20,000 that would be a class B felony. So right now under our law, a class B felony is a discretionary transfer to the adult court. I don't think that's what any of us want is, you know, a, a kid stealing a car for the first time is charged with a class B felony and possibly transferred to the, the adult court. Certainly not something that, that I would have happen. But what this does is it takes that incident out of the, the larceny schedule and it makes the first incident a class a uh, misdemeanor so not transferable to the adult court i think that's what we've been hearing about all through the last year we don't want these kids being transferred to adult court that's exactly what section 8 does because it's it's our intent that these kids go through a program and that they lead productive lives um, so, you know, I, I herald section eight here because it really makes it more difficult for that first offense. Um, and, and even a subsequent offense, because quite frankly, the first offense is usually dismissed through a diversionary program. So we're talking about the second incident of a juvenile stealing a car, um, right now can be transferred to the adult court. This prevents that. So, um. I do rise in support of this legislation I intend to vote in favor of, and uh, thank you, Mr. Chairman.